Wow, incredible ladies and gentlemen. I don't know why, but for some reason this butterfly does not feel like flying away right now. It's just sitting on my hand. Now the Old World Swallowtail Papilio Magalon is a species that we've seen on my channel countless and countless of times in all my outdoor videos. But getting close-ups of them can be difficult because they are very skittish and active during the day. But it turns out that right now for whatever reason this butterfly right here on my hand is just chilling there, it's not flying away. It's probably not gonna last for long, especially if the wind is sabotaging my plans. Maybe it's just kind of relaxing right now and doesn't feel like flying away, but wow! This is an amazing moment on my channel. Oh my god, I hope the wind would stop blowing. So this is, I said this many times, but this is the only species of swallowtail in my country, in the Netherlands. Some countries are very lucky to have dozens of species of swallowtails. Just go to a place like Brazil, I'm pretty sure there's over 100 species. But my country, Northern Europe, is not super biodiverse. And the Old World Swallowtail is kind of our only species of swallowtail that we have in these regions. It's very unfortunate. But you know what, I'm happy to have this one because they are absolutely gorgeous. They really are a gorgeous species in each and every respect. Um, they lay eggs on the Apiacea family, this includes carrot, fennel, milk parsley, cow parsley and many other plants. So uh, many of them are vegetables, like carrot and fennel. Humans are fond of them as well. For that reason they are sometimes uh, attracted to like vegetable gardens and stuff. It's pretty cool, just to lay their eggs on. I'm pretty sure that if in your garden you plant a carrot, there's a good chance a butterfly will come and lay eggs there. What a beauty, eh? Wow. Thank you butterfly. Oh my god, the wind. Really? I mean, how often does a wild butterfly sit on your hand? So I can't really complain about the wind, I guess. But still it's kind of annoying. Wow, this is a happy accident. This is so amazing. I don't think I've ever held a wild butterfly like this. This is really cool. I don't know why it's not scared. Maybe it's exhausted from flying away for too long. What a beautiful insect. This is the pride of my country, yay!